today. So, this is the good news. The good news is that 2,000 years ago, somebody walked the face of this earth. He was perfect without sin. And he laid his life down in your place. He took the wrath of God for your sins. He nailed your sins to the cross. He paid for your sins with his blood. So you'd be innocent on judgment day. That was Jesus Christ. Jesus told the Pharisees, you destroyed his body. I'll rebuild it on the third day. The tomb is empty, my friends. This is what Sunday is about. It's not about candy, chocolate eggs, or bunny rabbits. It's no. about death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Over 500 people. The Bible says in 1 Corinthians 15, over 500 eyewitness accounts of the resurrection of Jesus Christ. 500 eyewitness accounts. All you got to do is I watch like AD, I watch the History Channel. Someone's always driving off. Late at night, they see a UFO. Always by themselves. All you see is some kind of thing. There's no evidence behind it. Well, there are 500 eyewitness accounts of the resurrection of Jesus Christ. 500. Jesus oh, do you play took the wrath of God yeah. for sin on the cross. So you would be innocent on judgment day. The Bible says without that shedding of blood, there's no remission of sin. Your good works will not pay for your sin. Just like a criminal going for a judge. He says, judge, I'm looking for good work. The judge is going to say, you broke the law. You'll pay the fine today. God will not look the other way. Taking a trip to Mecca will not pay for your sin. Only the blood of Jesus Christ will pay for your sin. Jesus said, no one has saved my life. I can be the image. I can send out legions of angels. But he loved us that much that he died in our place for your sins. You need to repent and put your trust in Jesus Christ. Stop playing with your soul. Your soul is the most precious thing. But you have to figure out of sex. Storing a breath before God. That you're getting drunk. You're storing a breath. That you're smoking the wacky tobacco. You're storing a breath before holy God. In fact, the Bible calls that witchcraft. An alt mind altering drug that, that alters your mind and calls witchcraft in the Bible. So hold, you'll be held accountable for that. You can laugh all you want to, but you're going to go before a holy God. That's why I'm out here. 150,000 people die every single day. And they'll stand before a holy, righteous God. And what they've done in the dark will be shown in the light. Jesus spoke about hell before he spoke about heaven. Hello. You, you get a gospel chair? You, you guys get one? Hey man, did you get one? Yeah, yeah that's for you. That's for you. You sure? will be shown in the light when you're standing before a holy, righteous God. You'll be standing before a holy, righteous God. Like the Bible says, you'll be bare naked. And the God of the universe, who is love, but he's just. Psalm 711. Every single day, repent and put your trust in Jesus Christ. Somebody had to die. Somebody had to die for your sins so you could stand before the holy God of the universe. Sir, you get Somebody one? had to die before. That's the truth. God bless you. For my sins. So I That's important you. information on there. If God stood next to the sun. The sun would look pitch dark. This is how holy and righteous God is. My friend, somebody had to die, and he willingly died in your place. You need to repent, put your trust in Jesus Christ, not in your alcohol, not in your premarital sex, not in getting drunk. Repent, put your trust in Jesus Christ, and live for the Lord and Savior who died in your place have everlasting life. Or well, you can reject that 
You'll spend eternity in hell. Good boss, you get a gospel check. The blood of Jesus paid for your sins. Sure. Good enough to go have him. You pay for your sins in hell. But your sins will be paid for. Just like that civil court judge. God is much more demanding and righteous. He won't look the other way. You gotta get out of this mindset. Oh, what goes on in Vegas stays in Vegas. That doesn't work with God. He sees all things. And all you're doing is storing up wrath. And this world is your penitentiary. And you're waiting for judgment. You're waiting for judgment. You're out just like that. Thank God holds your breath in his hand. And he can take us all out just like that. Don't repent. Put your trust in Jesus Christ. And the whole thing is there. Your soul is the most precious thing. Your soul is the most precious thing. And without the blood of Jesus coming for your sins, you will pay for your sins, huh? attorney in hell. Jesus spoke about hell. He wanted to spoke about heaven. There'll be weeping, gnashing, teeth, eternal torment, and hell. Repent, call on Jesus Christ, and have eternal life. That is my prayer. Thank you.